Treasurer Ian Ling Starkey recently issued the New Island Provincial Government Budget with conditional approval. Conditional approval covers the first trifecta of the year for the months January to April inclusive, which enables the province to keep operating, but the treasurer has sought more compliance before full approval is given. Ling Starkey said two issues associated with the 2021 budget need to be satisfied before full approval is given. These are important issues that go to the heart of transparency and accountability of provincial operations and finances. He is calling for the submission of the Provincial Development Plan 2017 to 2022, not the corporate plan. The second area of concern is acquittals of all Lihi royalty funds from 2007 to 2020, totaling over 400 million kina. Ling Starkey stated that the province must submit its cash flow requirement for the operational and capital budgets to Treasury to facilitate the release of warrant authorities. He outlined the importance of providing full information to Treasury when submitting provincial budgets for approval. The 2021 provincial budget totals 238.8 million kina, consisting of public service and teacher leave fees of 3.3 million kina, national government current year, development grants of 37.5 million kina, recurrent internal revenue of 42.8 million kina, and development revenue of 73.2 million kina, and rollover development grants of 81.9 million kina. Frida Kana, TV1 News.